Hey, this is part two. I realized that the music was too loud. It was really low, actually, but the camera picked it up really loud. And I'm not making another one, so, um, what I was saying is, the two boats that came out of here, them boats are really, really long. Like, they hit, they hit against the frame before you actually get them out, so you will have to jack the engine up. You have most definitely jack it up. Alright? And, um, what else was I saying? I think that's everything that's really important really everything that's important and everybody should know how to take valve covers off most definitely they pretty fucking clean too clean them up I'm hoping this I'm trying to see how uh, how fast this engine is going to be when I get done building it. Alright, now it's actually time for the valve cover. And I noticed that the, the uh, I noticed that the, uh, what's that called? The window had a lot of glare in it. I tried to close the blinds a little bit. Um, now about this valve cover, it's only... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. It's 18 bolts to hold the, uh, the uh, valve cover in. And if you want, you can count them. Make sure you got all the bolts out. Because if you don't have all the bolts out, you will crack your flap, your, uh, you will crack your um, timer cover. You will crack your timer cover. Use a regular bolt for that one right there. It must, must be stripped. Let's see if this one Yeah. Yeah, I stripped my thing. That was a big delay.
Now, let me show you this. You have certain fire marks on <coughs> this motor. Like when it's sealed, it's going to be a pretty, pretty good seal. This is the prime mark right here. You see, if there's too much glue in there, you will have to actually clean it out and put a screwdriver in there and pry it open. This is one right here. One right here. And I usually use, what is it at? I put something like right here, like a breaker bar, and a prat right there. This is one right here underneath the car. You can prat right here. This is one right here. You prat right here. Then when you prat mark, so you won't damage your the valve cover. And you taking it off. Okay? And when you take these valve covers off, you do have to uh, clean them. So the thing about putting it on there. Next step is to actually flip the motor all the way around. Well, damn, I said flip the motor around. I'm going to need the car. I should put a pan right there. Alright, the reason why I put the motor over, and the reason why you're going to have to get on your back, or jack the car up, I should be able to jack that up, because it's, I think it's four more bolts in the inside of here, okay, it's four more in the inside here, so you're going to have to drain out all your oil, you, you should have been through that, if you didn't, you're crazy, alright now, let me try to figure out a way how I'm going to mount this, so I can, uh, so you, the camera can still see it. I may not be able to mount it. What I'm going to do pretty much is just take these off. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's ten bolts. Take this off. Bam. You're going to be going to have access to the other bolts that's holding the flap, the uh, time recovery on Okay, and I'm I'm just gonna make it a video. I'm not gonna make a video of me taking this off, but it's gonna be off for my next video, part three. And the only reason I'm breaking it up like the only reason I'm breaking it up like this is because um they only let you put ten minute videos on here. All right.